I mean, my name is Tanya Van Beeson, and I am the Executive Director of Catalyst Canada. And for those of you who are not familiar with Catalyst, Catalyst is a not-for-profit. In fact, we are the leading not-for-profit globally that advocates for the advancement of women in business through workplace inclusion. I believe so deeply that gender inequality is not a women's issue and that it is a, it's society's issue. If I can get a man with power to stand shoulder to shoulder with me and, at, and, and acknowledge publicly that he believes this is as much his problem as it is mine, then I see that as a very powerful thing. And then if further he will put his reputation on the line um, as we're trying to make change, I see that as an incredibly powerful thing. Now, a meritocracy is defined by the people in power. It's a very subjective thing, meritocracy. It is the great giant bucket of unconscious bias. Um, with respect to quotas, quotas are effective. I mean, quotas are, the, it's a legislated thing, it's a law, and therefore companies do what they're told. They are, they will address, if, if we impose quotas in Canada, they will address the representation of women on boards and we will see results quickly. Any quota system will address the near-term problem, but the question is, does it address the behavioral and the cultural change that underpins the problem? If the Trudeau government comes into a second term, I think it's possible they'll impose quotas. No one is demanding a business case for met all men on a board, right? That's just acceptable. So the business case argument to me is fraught with difficulty and denies the fact that I think this, this comes down to what is truly right and fair in a society.